Never before in history have we been able to generate and gather such vast amounts of health information about populations and individuals. For example, mapping the human genome has become not only possible, but affordable. And individuals' genetic and epigenetic information is already being used to determine the course of certain medical treatments, like with breast cancer. And just breathe normally, I'm going to listen to your heart. At the same time, we now have the computing power to store, organize, and retrieve the vast amounts of data that will accompany the inevitable increase in genetic testing. A necessary tool given that just one human chromosome is about 260 million base pairs long. In other arenas, operating rooms are becoming more wired to incorporate information technologies, while engineers are developing patient-specific computational models to inform the best clinical outcomes. However, in many ways, the American healthcare system is not operating as efficiently as it should. With health expenditures now surpassing $2.5 trillion annually, the U.S. spends more than double on medical expenses than any other peer nation. Yet some rankings place us at 38th in terms of life expectancy. And while electronic medical records are becoming more detailed, the system remains fragmented. Valuable patient information is not communicated across providers. Opportunities to compare and benefit from other similar medical cases are missed. And poor use of health information contributes to expensive end-stage treatments rather than promoting prevention and healthy choices up front. Can we become more efficient by mining the resource of people's specific traits like family and environmental factors to not only tailor their health care but also benefit other patients facing similar circumstances? What will we do to prepare for the flood of genetic information? How can clinical practice best keep up with research developments? And can we eliminate costly, painful tests that will add little to improve medical decisions? through the Johns Hopkins Individualized Health Initiative, which draws upon our distinctive history as a medical, research, and learning institution. We will harness our expertise in patient care, population health, bioethics, and big data science to not only use information to personalize treatment for sick patients, but create new screening protocols for early diagnosis and prevention. And by developing new technological tools and information sharing strategies to maximize the use of health data, we will increase the efficacy of care and empower people with the knowledge to promote their own well-being. And in the process, we will quite simply revolutionize the U.S. healthcare system as we know it. <laughs>